Yo, I'm a gun club member. I'm gonna take these rookies downtown. Are you with me? Hey, what's your name, son? Sweet, man. I don't think that's such a good idea. Yeah? They said catching that pass in my high school championship football game was a bad idea, because I broke my leg in 13 places, but I scored a touchdown and won the game. The world was built out of bad ideas, my friend. Come on. The PE-4 has been molded and is set to explode in 60 seconds. Now listen, people. We're your friends. Me and me brother here. Why are we... you telling them we're brothers, you idiot? That's gonna make it hard for them to find us, isn't it? I'm trying to be honest with these people. We put them through a lot today. Fuck these people. Fuck your cause. That shit's over. Ireland's not the only thing that's green. Dollars are too. Now you've said bloody Ireland. That's gonna narrow the search, ain't it? Fuck you! Take the needle out your arm, then tell me what to do. I'll let you tell me what to do when you stop shoving half of Bolivia up your nose every Saturday night! Motherfucker! <laughs> fuck! Oh. We told you not to fuck with us! Oh. Shit! Michael! <laughs> Save fucking Michael! <laughs> fuck you, shit! Get the money! Me and my brother are watching the kids! Yeah, look, I'm here. Yeah, like I said, man, everything's a little fussy. Well, if you think of anything else, Mr. Lopez. Yeah, sure, sure, I'll give you a call. Thanks. Yo, what's up, Bobby? Hey, Chris? Hey. Hey, Tony, it's me. Yeah, there was a bomb at the bank. The place got robbed. Nothing to do with me, I, I swear. Um, some Irish guys. Anyway, um, listen, I'm coming over, okay? So wake up. You hear me? Wake up. Hey, mommy, go with that. Yeah, I'm sorry. Yeah, no, I, I was working late at the club. Yeah, mommy, don't be like that, okay? I'll be home soon. Look, I, I gotta go. Okay. Who the fuck is it? It's me, though. Oh, whatever. Come up. How are you? I'm good, boss. How are you? Oh, you look terrible. <laughs> That's good, because I am terrible. Fucking wretched. What's wrong? Oh, the usual. Boyfriend thinks I'm a cash machine. One nightclub catering to the rich, mindless crowd. In a city where the rich, mindless crowd is suddenly poor and mindless. Another club catering to the gay and decadent crowd, where the gay and decadent crowd suddenly think decadence means buying outrageous new throw cushions instead of getting loaded in a bar. And every half-wit, part-time hood in this city thinking, I know. Let's put the squeeze on the club owners. They must really, really want to substitute my inadequacies with their money because, after all, they want to stay up all night talking bullshit to morons because they enjoy it. it sounds pretty usual. Oh, thanks for the support. Hey, that's what I'm here for, boss. Mm -hmm. Yes, you know, if the bodyguard business partner thing doesn't work out, you should consider a career as a fucking life coach. A uh, what? Never mind. Did you speak to Troy? Yeah, he said he loves you, but he can't handle working the door at a gay club anymore. He says people are laughing at him. Who's laughing at him? I don't know. I think the little people who live in his head. The ones stuck in 1955. <laughs> oh, I love those people. And what's up with Desi? Yeah, he says he saw you last night. Yeah, and you was holding court with that Chloe Parker until uh, 4 a.m.? I was? Apparently so. Oh, my God. 45 years old, and I get my kicks doing blow with 17-year-old kids. His only claim to fame is that people know better what their vagina looks like than their face. I should be sent to prison. Shouldn't I? Yeah, most definitely. What's this money? Did you rob your own club? 
Tony, I just went to the bank for you, man. I don't want it in the bank. Hey, Tony, the door was open. Man, it's easier to get into your apartment than into your nightclub. Yeah, we have a no guido policy at the club. Here I ain't so sure. Oh, I love getting racially abused by a spick. Yeah, who's a fucking taco, Tony? Uh, my business partner, Luis. Gentlemen, watch your language. We're in the great melting pot. We're not spicks or guidos or fags. We're proud Americans. Luis, this is Vince and Rocco, relatives of Gracie. And credit is to you. And guess what? We ain't here about Gracie. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> That's a start. I guess we don't have to beat you two lovers up. <laughs> yeah, good luck. See you later. Oh, nice to meet you, muscles. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> Fuck, there goes payroll. Who the fuck were those two assholes, T? <laughs> Fine men of the cloth. Who the fuck do you think they are? Ancelotti goons I borrowed money from way back. Uh, never mind. Amateurs. Come on, let's get out of here. Let's go. Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, and we're here with episode 1 of Grand Theft Auto, The Ballad of Gay Tony. Uh, it's been a long time coming, obviously the final expansion of the GTA 4 Give it up, Tom. game in general. Where'd the cash come from? Well, tell me you've been running a skim job. 100% legitimate, Luis. You know me. Total transparency. Sometimes I wonder if you brought me on as a partner just to share the blame when the IRS comes knocking. I was investing in your industry and acumen. Don't look for anything sinister Steven. here. That's what you say, T. But I'm kind of suspicious. Maybe witnessing that robbery made me paranoid. And maybe it's just hanging out with you. Who the fuck knows? Okay, so obviously, as well, this is the first game to introduce the gold medal system, which means there are certain requirements you have to do in the mission to get a gold rating. Uh, we've seen it before in Red Dead Redemption. We'll see it again in GTA V. Uh, for this one in particular, you have an objective to complete the mission in 4 minute 30 and also to keep the car damage um, below 10% and also not to take any player damage, but that one shouldn't be too difficult. Troy, get over here. A very important client is coming tonight. We need complete discretion. Hey, <laughs> you know me, Tone. Don't ask, don't tell. Military grade. Hey! This is serious. He's paranoid no one will buy his next CD if they know he'd rather be singing cabaret than rapping. As if people buy CDs anymore. Sure. Look, I really need to talk blah, to you, Tony. Blah, blah, blah. Another time, Troy. We'll be at Masonette! Okay. Just this guy's, uh, you know, on tax service. Don't run into me. I can't Troy's take damage. getting anxious. We should all be getting anxious. The nightclub business is going to shit. Forget the banks, we're the ones who needed a bailout. No more that shit left, eh? Okay, okay. Time to be charming, Lord. So the two clubs are like within walking right, distance of each other. Hey, but I thought they'd been under the side of the city. Okay, okay. Welcome to Mason at Nine. You can try to impress the ladies who are dancing. If you dance successfully with a lady, you may get a surprise. Okay. You can get some shots at LeVar. Or you can go upstairs to the VIP area and start take part of the drinking game. And um, we're actually gonna be doing both eventually. Um uh, the part of hundred percent requirements. And get in the club. Okay. Well let's see if we can actually uh get that done. So where's the VIP area? Let's see if we can get that one done now. Hello everybody. Oh, hello. Tony! What's up, Tom? I'm told one of your friends is going to try to run the I don't know what it is. I don't know anything about it, but take care of it, Louis. No nonsense. 
Also, oh, there's no time for that. How are we doing? Uh, okay. We have a Tony in our phone. That's a bit sad. You've only got your boss. Alright, third is. What's going on? Why are you laying your hands on me like that, man? Luis is my boy! Luis is his Half boy! Half the people in here say Luis is their boy. The girls all say they're fucking him. I don't care if you're his damn mother. You ain't coming in. Not in them clothes. Not with that attitude. Enjoy looking for a job in this economic climate, motherfucker! Yeah! Yo, what the fuck, eh? Tell this clipboard and earpiece motherfucker to back up, pal. Back up! Yo, what's the problem, D? You asking me? Yo, relax. Go inside. I got it. Yeah, go relax. Go inside, eh? Oh, no, mommy. You need to okay. go relax. Later for you. Nice. Ah. Right, shut up. Okay? Jeez. Wow. Downtown's really changed you, man. You too good to take money from me and Enrique now? You know it ain't even like that, bro. Okay? You don't pay for shit in here. Okay? You just can't be looking like you came from selling dope on the corner. You say that like it's a bad thing. Tony, what do you think? <laughs> Jesse wouldn't let me address like that, huh? See what I mean? Come to think of it, Lou, what the fuck are you wearing, huh? What? Go home and take a bath. <laughs> Do nothing else. Put on some clothes, huh? Yeah, I had a complicated day, okay? All right. So take some time off. The girl's neck could use a night off, too. <laughs> we up. Bye-bye, gentlemen. Nice boss you got there. You stuck a fucking fag. Mike, come on. Hey. Okay, looks like we're not getting the, the uh, activities in the masonette done. Okay, um... I'm not sure if the mission uh, time requirements count the cutscenes. I know they do in GTA 5, but uh, oh, yeah. it didn't seem to in Red Dead. So. How many days a week you work those corners? Seven days. Junkies need junk, rain, sleep, or shine. You ain't no postman, loco. You a pusher. All those hours, you'd make more slinging meat at Burger Shot than risking a bit on them corners. Um, we might not get like the. Timer. Think Enrique could get a job at we'll get the other twos. What's that QH? 76, motherfucker. What they gonna let you do at Burger Shop with an IQ sub 80? They're just about to let me wash the goddamn dishes. You see what I mean now? They don't even have dishes at Burger Shop. All this shit is polystyrene. There ain't another job in the city for this dumb bastard to do. Hourly wage considered and all. You don't get no pussy work in Burger Shop, neither. So yeah, the general rule is we're going to try and get as many options as we can on camera and then the rest of them I'll just do in between episodes. Dude, where are you going? You guys are better than this. I don't want any of us to go away again. And come on board with us. We can start selling our own product. Your connections, man. We'll have the whole city on our gear. I took a bit for you once, man. I ain't going back then. You think I put in all this work to go back inside? Hmm, interesting. Prison was the best thing that happened to you, pal. What the fuck are you talking about, man? Before you went in there, you was a skinny little shit, and now you pumped up. Don't tell me that sugar daddy of yours would have been interested in the scrawny fucker that went away. Little Luis, little Luis. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you so much, man. Never thought about being grateful to you for signing me up to the fight-off, hairy-ass rapist day and night exercise plan. My fucking pleasure, bro. <laughs> okay, okay. Here we be. Thanks, Luis. Ladies, Al, tell that boss of yours we'll be back same time next week. Yeah, see you on my huevos. <laughs> okay, I think that's the end of the mission. Not too sure. Oh, no, never mind. We're gonna go back to our apartment. But I see, you're supposed to be able to do this, you know, even with cutscenes excluded in 4 minute 30. But uh, there must be a way, obviously. I hope they're not as tight as it was in Red Dead, but it's looking like it probably is. Those requirements were horrible. Alright. Nobody crash into me. Or at least not too far away. Alright. You can save any vehicle in the back of inside your apartment. Yeah, same as the last two games. It's a pretty nice crypt though. Okay. This is Luis's apartment. Yeah. Sleeping on the bed will save the game and advance time by six hours, as per usual. 
And the many people who played the Baldur Gate tourney without playing GTA 4 or Lost and Damned. Uh, you can use the wardrobe to change clothes. Yep. Oh, can you actually change clothes in this game? That's interesting. Uh, oh, look at that. We were just over it. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, I take it doesn't count um, timers then. Alright, but I was being delicate with the um, car damage. But, uh, yeah, so I'll get that off camera. So, I love LC. Oh, good. Uh, you can repeat them. Good. Good, 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 good. Okay, come on. So yeah, 4 minute 30, 10% damage. So yeah, we're 12 seconds over. That sucks. Okay, no worries. Just punch the air. That's cool. Oi? Yeah, it's me, Tom. Things go smooth at the clubs? <laughs> Made me wonder why I need you around at all. Oh, great. I might just take a vacation then. Come on, hmm. I was kidding. The clubs fell apart without you. So that bank robbery on the news could have been an opportunity for some positive PR. Fuck that shit. I don't need any press like that. Not with the way police treat an ex-con in this town. <laughs> have it your way. See you soon. Okay. Let's head on out. Okay, let's have a look at our map. What can we do? Not a lot at the moment, it would seem. Uh, let's check out the the uh, internet cafe. Do we actually have any money? Um, so what do they say? Does it? Hang on, oh, wait, have a look at our stats. Um, so, Tony Progress 9.09, yeah, he has, does have quite a few missions. Um, so, 50% progress with. Sorry, no, yeah. So, like and respect for Henrique is 50, and same with Armando. And 80%. Oh, so it, it has the missions at the bottom and it tells you how far we did. Um, so, how do you replay missions? How do you replay missions? This is Tony. You haven't gotten hold of Troy if it Okay. So we get here from calling people. Sorry, I didn't get you. Alright, no one's talking to us. This is Adria, please. Thank No, yeah. Hang on, did you call Tony? No, I didn't, did I? This is Tony. Okay, never mind. Well, these missions have come available now. He didn't. Oh, we couldn't call him. It's a bit weird, but fine. Don't spill shit on the yeah, I won't. Don't worry. Oh, we got four pieces of mail. So we got mags. Uh. Okay. Okay, uh, so let's just get those deleted, get them off my computer. Yeah, how do we replay missions? I might just have to look that up, but it's cool. Alright, we've got $499 to our name, that is fantastic. Yeah, uh, it doesn't look like we can do much else. Um, Once you complete all missions in the game, you have to, you'll be able to repeat missions. Oh, blimey. Oh, so I can't do it. Oh, that's annoying. Oh. Alright, fair enough. Oh, hang on. Someone texted us. Good do with some help at Masonette. Come by during opening hours or I'll see you on the loft. T. Okay. Move out of the way, please. Guys, come on. Shift us. 
Yeah, I thought we could just replay them, like, because you can do that in Red Dead, it literally has an option dedicated to missions, and it just says, would you like to repeat the mission, and you do it, but... Oh, hang on, we've got another one available as well. Oh, that's not the Masonette, isn't it? Wait, who's this? Tony's absent, what's this then? It's only available. Wait, what? Okay. Fair enough. Yeah, so, um... I guess we'll have to wait. I don't know what that's about. So, he's got two missions and it depends what time of day it is that you can do them, I guess. I don't know. Fair dues. I know I've got to set up like a few back-to-back -back missions for Tony, so... I don't know. Honestly, I've never played this game. I have no idea what to expect. Um, I'll probably do a lot more work when it comes to... Um, when I finish the episode and have a look up what we're going to be doing. Obviously next time we'll probably start, we'll probably start the next five episodes dealing with the seagulls as we did in Lost and Damned. So... But I think we're going to limit the extent of how much stuff we do off screen, off camera, so... We'll have a look, but we're going to start up, well we'll start up, uh, Chinese Takeout. Hey man. Hey bro. Tony in? Yeah. Maury, Maury, shit, no, no, Maury, Maury, no, I, I got the money, seriously, that's not the issue, no, I just want to make you happy, is, is there anything else my team can do for you, no, we can do events, parties, <laughs> no, anything you like, just, just give it a think, all right, bye-bye, what a dick, what's up, T, oh, I don't want to think about what's up, come on, there's something I got to take care of, You remember me? Of course, of course. Uh, my business partner, Mr. Lopez. Yusuf Amir. What is up, homie? Not much. <laughs> hey, you guys want to join us maybe for uh, a bit of this or a bit of that? Ah, uh, we'd love to, but we gotta go deal with some business. Okay, good. Good seeing you. Yeah. Take care, huh? Oh, 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 oh. And uh, if you ever want to talk about franchising this place, huh? Just give me a call. We will. We absolutely will. I... <laughs> <laughs> Let's go, I'm in the mood, baby. Ya wallahi, ha, ha, wallahi, ha. Okay, fair enough. Okay, uh, okay. Fate to to Dragon Hat Plaza. Okay, coming to our optionals, we should be having a, expecting a bit of a. Just in case. Just in case. Yeah, a bit of a gunfight. What the? I know a guy who gave me a deal. What can I say? It helps to be prepared. Tony, man, we're going to Chinatown? Really? What? We got business. Tony, you know what you like on the MSG. Those fucking headaches. You won't leave the house. Or for a fucking echo. Ay, Dios mío. Oh, I'm glad you care. It ain't that I care. It's that I can't take the money. Well, we're not heading out for dim sum. Rocco's asked to talk to someone. The rent the Guido pretended to be a gangster. Now I wish we were getting take up. Hey, we're in debt to the kid and his uncle, and he's got the ear of one of the most powerful families in the city. We gotta at least pretend to play ball. Yeah, huh? Okay, where is this? Oh, it's just around the corner. Good. Good, 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 good. Now we actually have to get 100% headshot accuracy on this one, which is... gonna be fun for sure. I don't know how well this that's gonna go down. Alright, let's have a look. In that case, I guess my brother is in good hands. You take care of that prick. It seems the definition of family loyalty differs in your country. The marketplace has a value for everything, and I guess that a disloyal Jew bastard ain't worth shit to me. Brother or no brother. 
Such are the heady joys of consumer capitalism. A system that's flaws are becoming increasingly evident. Ah, <laughs> that's right, I forgot. You little yellow people are commies too, huh? Both sides of the fence? You know, I grew up watching your kind getting killed on the TV. Hell of a show. I'm sure, but perhaps the show wasn't as much fun as the reality of that war. Hmm, perhaps not. Now I bid you farewell, sir, and don't do all that smack at once. On second thought, you know, go ahead. Do. Boo. Hey, what's it, you greaseball fuck? I apologize for our associate's uncouth manner. I can only say that our partnership with him is one of necessity, not volition. Please, you must be the famous Tony Prince. Ah, uh, notorious, maybe. This is Luis Lopez, my business partner. Hey. Mr. Pelosi has led me to expect much from this meeting. Ah, yeah, about that. Rocco has a tendency to promise more than he can deliver. So that must have been weaned too early. Yeah, we're not weaned at all. As you can see, we are already behind schedule on this project. We need you to, uh, how do I put this, to uh, clear things with the planning department and to ease some licensing troubles. Hey, look, we're not lawyers, okay? We run nightclubs, pretty badly, too. We got enough trouble keeping the licenses on our own clubs, okay? We don't do licenses. Before I was being polite, Mr. Lopez, but I do not have to be. Mr. Pelosi made it clear that you are not in a position to choose who you help and who you do not. Yeah, well, that kid's got a big mouth, okay? And he ain't in no position to be writing checks for us, okay? We are not going to be able to help you, period. Let's go, Tom. Sorry to waste your time, Mr. Um... Well, you are not going anywhere until we have an arrangement. No, I'm afraid we are. There is no arrangement. You got a problem? Take it up with your boy Rocco. <laughs> you are not negotiating column inches and bar tabs, you insolent fuck! We are serious people! <laughs> really? Hmm. Yeah, really! <clears throat> what is wrong with you? I was supposed to be the irrational idiot with the anger issues. I got anger issues. Okay, the guy threatens to shoot me because I can't arrange a liquor license for him. Please, give me a break, T. Oh, God. Oh, sh They're coming for us. All right, nice little time with uh, Lost and Damned there. So, obviously, it was Billy who set up that deal. All right. For goodness sake, come on. Seriously? Nope, you're not coming out now. Now what you want? Right, that was a headshot. That's good. Come up here, bro. This is very difficult. To maintain all of the optionals, including 100% accuracy with headshots. No, 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 no it's 70% accuracy, and all of them have to be headshots. And with that, I'm not allowed to take any damage. Oh, wait, well, 10% of damage. And 70% headshot. Headshot, 70% uh, accuracy. Again, then forget it. Come, big guy. Come on. Come on. 
Give me some health. Oh, armor. Armor's good. We like armor. Hmm. You can come down now. I got this asshole. Oh my word. Come up here, bro. You know, for a mission two, this is a lot of you know, they're really throwing you in the deep end here, aren't they? Especially with Not the fucking fun. I need help. Right. Oh man. We are all around you. Hey, we don't want to fight you. I think we've maintained headshot accuracy so far. He's aiming right for us. Get down. Come on, I shot him in the head. How much more motivation do you need? Right, come on, any time today. Oh. All right. Perfect. Keep Just your air on. Oh man, this is gonna be. Just get oh, that was nice. I knew Rocco was a piece of shit. Oh my word, how many more enemies do we need? We're supposed to get 100% shot, 100% headshots on that, and also limit play damage to 10%, and with 70% accuracy. I'm doing it in five minutes twenty. So do I, mate. <laughs> I don't see how the hell you're supposed to be able to do that one. I don't get gold. But okay, fair enough. Right, okay, fair enough. Just run corner. That was worse than spinning class. My fucking heart. Hey, you need to look after yourself. I'm soaked through. I must have lost three pounds in sweat. Yeah, don't go looking for a right side. Marco's big mouth nearly got us killed. Fuck. When I get a hold of him? You won't do anything, Lou. You'll play it nice. We can use this if we're smart. We were dumb enough to walk into the death trap for the kid. I doubt we're gonna pull brains out of our asses now. Leave it to me. You just concentrate on looking pretty. Yeah, absolutely, T. You've done such a great job so far. <laughs> Alright. You're gonna call Rocco then? Rip him a new one? I got a feeling we ain't the only ones who'll be ripping him, Lou. God, I need my pills. Don't take that shit, T. I'm serious. Okay. I should at least have one. Yeah. Targets. Yeah, how the hell are you supposed to be able to do that? That is honestly BS. Okay. I don't know if you have to do them all in a one go. If so, that is just not something I'm looking forward to. <laughs> um, okay, now I don't know how long we're doing because I accidentally uh, ended the timer. But uh, we'll wrap up here. So we've got 4.8% of the way through the game. Not too shabby. 18.8%. 18% of the way through um, Tony's missions. We've got 82% on Isle of LC and 62% on Chinese takeout. 
So that is where we're going to wrap it up for today. In the next episode, I'm going to start out with the seagulls, uh, our first set of seagulls, and uh, we'll see if we can get any more side stuff done. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and don't forget to share the video. And I'll see you guys in episode two. Bye, guys. Oh,